Yes guys, welcome back to the channel. Now, fun fact and quick disclaimer, whatever you want to call it, I enjoy watching food videos. Yes, I like food. That's not a shock, that's not a surprise. However, I like watching like people try out obscure food, food that's generally got a bad rap, and especially, especially, especially like rations, so like army rations, things like that. And I'd like to get, when you know when I set out the 2021 plan, for the channel, I'd like to bring in niche things like that into the channel. So, look out for like more food stuff. I'm gonna be doing stuff from like the WWE cookbooks, stuff like that. However, that's not what this video is about, as you'll be able to tell by the title. Now, we are trying some of the best, I say best, some of the most obscure microwave foods. Now, obviously, rustlers are best known for their microwavable burgers. And big shout out to Ashens. He'll probably never see this video because his channel is way bigger than mine. But he done a he done a couple of videos on like microwavable foods, um, quicksters and rustlers. Now I've got a few that I don't think he's actually reviewed yet, and a few that I believe to be quite obscure. There is one that he has reviewed. I'm on this normal, but these caught my eye, and I thought, you know what, YouTube baby. So I've got four different rustlers products to try today and they are as followed we have got your bog standard you know you get a microwavable burger this is the double decker two burgers in one jeez madness that is that then you've got what ashton's reviewed it's slightly different this is your all day breakfast sausage muffin if you haven't got time to go to mcdonald's Boom! Chat in the microwave. You're welcome. Probably not going to taste great. Then you've got one that I've never actually seen before, which is a southern fried chicken sub. High hopes for this. Do not let me down. It's made with 100% chicken breast. Decent. And last but not least, I can't imagine this one being great, but we've got a classic hot dog. With your tomato ketchup and mustard, we've talked enough, haven't we? Let's bang some food in the microwave. Now, for the purpose of the video, and because obviously they're going to know how to best cook their food, surely, we're going to follow it letter for letter on the cooking instructions. So, they recommend remove burger from packaging. Check. Okay. Uh, pop the bun in the toaster, the patties in the microwave, and then rebuild your burger. Add the cheese slice and the burger sauce for the perfect melt. Squeeze over our signature sauce. Oh, uh, yeah. And enjoy. So, buns in the toaster, patties are in the microwave. Now we've just got to enjoy, hopefully. All right. So the burger is built. Obviously, we've gone for the double decker first. I, I think I built this quite well, you know. Bun, burger, cheese, burger, sauce, bun. Now, I think I toasted the bun a bit too long. It's gone. Hear that ASMR sh stuff. Um, yeah, the, it's a toasted bun. I've toasted it. I think you're just supposed to heat it. I just toasted it, let it pop. You're not having none. Or I'm going to have some, and you're not. But yeah, that's that. It's hot. But we're going to tuck in and hopefully not drop it everywhere. Although she's hoping I do. Okay. Now again, I made this video. Oh, it's nice and soggy at the bottom. It's, yeah, literally, I just got that off the bottom of the bun. It is soggy. Oh, fuck. Flip it's hot. Mm. Yeah, I toasted the bun far too long. It's a microwavable burger, but there's two of them. Next. Okay, what we got next? Oh, sausage. I can't really call it a McMuffin, because that'd be copyright. But it's a sausage muffin. Now, this one you cook all together, put it in a microwave all together. It don't really smell of anything. It's overloaded with ketchup. 
Didn't have to toast the bun, but the bun is toasted already. Just had to heat it. Um, yeah. Uh, it's a. It's supposed to be a McMuffin, but obviously for legal issue issue. Yeah, for legal reasons, it can't be. So, again with that soggy bottom. <laughs> Again with your soggy bottom. Yeah, overloaded with ketchup. I just chucked the whole sachet in. That was a bit of bun. That was nice. You are not having any. Alright. Um, yeah, let's give it a go. Mm. Yeah, I'd give that a miss. I'd eat it. Because I paid for it. Um, but yeah. And so I can't quite put my finger on what's not right about it, but everyone lives near a McDonald's. Go and get yourself an actual McMuffin. Alright, up next we have got the hot dog. That is mustard and ketchup. Um, yeah, I don't have high hopes for this one. Minnie does, but she's not getting any. Because it's not good for humans. I hate to think what it do to her insides. Does it have a soggy bottom? You bet your soggy bottom it does. Um, bon, bon app trees. Hmm. You know what? That's alright. Now, let me tell you a little story. I love IKEA for their cheap hot dogs. And that is exactly what that reminds me of. So, that for me gets. Yeah, that gets a pass. The grand finale. The chicken sub. I'm trying to tip it, but I don't want it to fall off the plate. With creamy mayonnaise. Rustler's words. Not mine. Now, if you can see the bun, then I was capturing that on camera, the little speckles. That's not mould. I didn't read the packaging, so I don't quite know what it is. So I'm hoping it's not mould anyway, but I assume it's supposed to look like that. You are not having none. Um, Alright, I'm actually stuffed, but <laughs> I've got to try it. So that's what this videos and these upcoming videos are all about, isn't it? It's a lot of mayonnaise. A lot of mayonnaise. As I said, just chuck the whole sachet on and use everything that was there. Let's try it. I don't know what's that about. It. It's a couple of chicken goujons in um. I guess it's supposed to be a herby sub, but you can't really taste it. It's a couple of chicken goujons in a sub. It is what it is, isn't it? And yeah, that was that. Four Rustler's Burgers, or one Rustler's Burger, and three different alternates. Let me know how you found the video. Let me know if you want to see me do more stuff like this. I really want to do more stuff like this, not just with weird Rustler's microwavable food but as I say I really want to do like meal rations camping rations like MREs things like that some food challenges so let me know what you want to see in the comment section down below remember to like the video smash that subscribe button share the video about with all your friends I will love you forever you've all been beautiful I've been John from K12 Productions and I will see you all very very soon